Now, from Into Tomorrow, this is an ITTV special report. It's Caitlin. I'm here at Jungle Island in Miami, Florida. We're checking out a lot of cool things here, such as the orangutans and how they're using the iPads. Check it out! Why are you using this iPad for the orangutan? Well, we'd like to use the iPad so that, for one thing, for conservation purposes, so that people can get to know the orangutans and see how intelligent they are and maybe make a step in helping save them. The orangutans are highly endangered, so, you know, if any awareness can be brought to the species, it would be amazing. What made you come up with this idea? Well, a scientist named Jack Kasowitz, he originally worked with dolphins, and he was using the iPad with them. And what he did was he was interested in seeing if the orangutans could use the iPad too. So he brought the iPad over and they've been very intrigued with it. <laughs> when did you start this whole iPad? We started using the iPad about a year ago. Can you tell us who these orangutans are and how old they are? Yes, okay, over here we have Hannah. Hannah is our 14 year old orangutan. Down here we have Jake. Jake is 12 years old. And up here, this is Little Pumpkin, and she is our youngest. She's eight years old. So our main goal with the iPad is we're going to put a variety of fruits and vegetables, and then we're going to ask them to identify what they would like for lunch or what they would like for dinner. So what we're doing is we're giving them a choice and a voice. When they're not feeling well, is there a way they can tell you that they aren't feeling well? Yeah, so what we have is the same app we use. We put body parts instead of fruits and vegetables, and we'll ask them to touch the body part, and then they'll actually touch their hand or their nose or their belly. So eventually they'll be able to tell us if their head hurts, if their stomach hurts, if they have a toothache, stuff like that. When you were training them how to like use it and telling them what you do, was it hard? Um, at first it was kind of hard, just getting them not to grasp the iPad itself, but other than that, they're extremely intelligent, so they pretty much got it like that. Why do you have to hold the iPads for them? Like, why can't they hold them themselves? Well, orangutans are extremely strong. Jake, for example, is about as strong as 10 men, so if we gave him this iPad, he'd probably take it apart. <laughs> do you think that one day you could just give it to them and let them do it on their own? awesome if we could do that. If somebody could design an iPad that would sustain their strength, that would be amazing. <laughs> yeah, that would be amazing. <laughs>